The Iloilo Cathedral, officially known as the Cathedral of St. Elizabeth of Hungary, is a historic religious landmark located in the city of Iloilo in the Philippines. With its rich history dating back several centuries, the cathedral holds great significance for the Catholic community in the region. Let's delve into the captivating history behind the Iloilo Cathedral. The origins of the Iloilo Cathedral can be traced back to the Spanish colonial period in the Philippines. When the Spanish arrived in the region in the 16th century, they brought with them their religion, Catholicism. As the Spanish established settlements and spread their influence, they built churches as symbols of their faith and power. In the early 18th century, the Jesuit order took charge of the Catholic mission in the area that is now Iloilo. They constructed a small chapel dedicated to St. Elizabeth of Hungary, which served as the first church in Elizabeth of Hungary, which served as the first church in Iloilo. However, due to various challenges and conflicts, the Jesuits eventually left the region and the administration of the church was transferred to the Augustinians. The Augustinians, recognizing the growing population and the need for a larger place of worship, decided to construct a new church. The construction of the new church began in 1814 under the guidance of Spanish friar Fray Francisco Manuel Blanco. The church was built using coral stones, a common material in the region, and the locals actively participated in its construction. Over the years, the church underwent several renovations and expansions to accommodate the growing congregation. It gradually transformed from a modest chapel to a grand cathedral. The architectural style evolved as well, transitioning from the simple Baroque style to a more elaborate neo-Gothic design, incorporating elements such as pointed arches, ribbed vaults, and intricate stained glass windows. However, the cathedral did not escape the ravages of time and natural disasters. In 1867, an earthquake severely damaged the church, leading to its subsequent reconstruction. Tragically, the church was once again destroyed by an even more devastating earthquake in 1948. Undeterred, the faithful community rallied together to rebuild their beloved cathedral. The post-war reconstruction of the Iloilo Cathedral was completed in 1956, with the faithful eagerly attending the inauguration ceremony. The new cathedral, blending elements of neo-Gothic and contemporary architecture, showcased the resilience and devotion of the people of Iloilo. Today, the Iloilo Cathedral stands as a testament to the enduring faith of the Catholic community in Iloilo. Its magnificent facade, adorned with intricate details, attracts both religious pilgrims and architectural enthusiasts. The interior of the cathedral is equally impressive, featuring ornate altars beautiful stained glass windows, and a majestic pipe organ. The cathedral is not only a place of worship, but also an integral part of the city's cultural heritage. It has witnessed numerous religious ceremonies, important events, and celebrations throughout its history. The annual Dinagyang Festival, one of the most significant festivals in the Philippines, includes a religious procession that passes by the cathedral, showcasing the vibrant religious and cultural traditions of the region. The Iloilo Cathedral continues to serve as a spiritual sanctuary and a beacon of faith for the people of Iloilo. It stands as a living testament to the enduring power of religion and the unwavering devotion of the community that has upheld it for centuries.